All right, thanks, Jeff. A couple of downtown businesses with prime locations remain for sale after being on the market for several months now. However, the agency responsible for promoting the downtown believes those businesses could soon be sold. John Last has more. State Street has been bustling this summer. Many special events are bringing people to downtown to spend money. The two prime locations have not been a part of the excitement. The under-the-clock restaurant inside the old Boston store building has been closed since November 20th. The establishment, the Boston store, where under-the-clock used to be, is definitely an area that we would love to see uh, someone go in. John Bookna is CEO of the Erie Downtown Partnership. The agency helps potential businesses locate in the downtown. The under-the-clock property has been receiving interest. We've had con contacts and or phone calls from prospective business owners about it. Uh, we've made a few phone calls, so we that's an area that we would love to see developed as well. The Cell Block nightclub has been closed since March 2nd. A sale nearly went through early this month. The current owners are, are looking at it from their business standpoint, and, and they were, if you will, somewhat selective as to who they felt that they wanted to uh, sell to. And in this particular case, they said it wasn't to their liking, so they're going to engage in more talks going forward. Bookness says there is a new prospective buyer. That group wants to keep a nightclub at the cell block property, but it would be a nightclub like Erie has never seen before. Ultimately, they're looking to do something different that hasn't been done in downtown, which makes it unique because it will be a tr true destination. The downtown partnership in cooperation with government agencies has programs available to entice new businesses to the downtown. One of those programs is for new facades for storefronts. So that pot of money is great news because it's a good investment that's coming back to downtown Erie, and we're very proud of that. Both the under the clock and cell block properties would be eligible to receive the funding. In Erie, John Last reporting. And it's unknown if the under-the-clock property will remain a restaurant since most of the equipment has been removed.